So let's do the integral of ln of x squared plus 1. Similar to the integral of ln of x, we should start off by doing integration by parts. We let u equal ln of x squared plus 1, which is what we need to differentiate, and dv equal dx, which is what we need to integrate. If we differentiate the u, we get du equals 2x over x squared plus 1 dx. Because if you apply the chain rule, the derivative of ln of x squared plus 1 is just 1 over x squared plus 1 using the derivative of ln x equals 1 over x, and then we have to multiply by the derivative of x squared plus 1, which is just 2x. So the entire derivative is 2x over x squared plus 1 dx. The integral of dx is x, so v is equal to x. If we apply the integration by parts formula listed on the right hand side, then we know that the integral of ln of x squared plus 1 is equal to uv, which is equal to ln of x squared plus 1, which is the u, times x, which is the v. So that's x ln of x squared plus 1 minus the derivative of v du. So v is equal to x and du is equal to 2x over x squared plus 1 dx. So that's minus the integral of 2x squared over x squared plus 1, since x times 2x over x squared plus 1 is just the rational function, 2x squared over x squared plus 1, and then dx. So we need to do the integral of the rational function, 2x squared over x squared plus 1. To do this, we need to use polynomial long division to split the rational function into a sum of a polynomial and a fraction with the same denominator of x squared plus 1, but the numerator has a degree of less than that of the denominator. So basically, we have a quadratic, which is a polynomial of degree 2 in the denominator, and we also have a quadratic in the numerator. We need the numerator to have a degree of 1 or less, so it has to be a linear term or a constant term in this case. So if we go ahead and do the polynomial long division where we divide the numerator of the rational function 2x squared by the denominator x squared plus 1, the quotient turns out to be 2, and we're left with a remainder of negative 2. So we can actually rewrite the rational function 2x squared over x squared plus 1 as the quotient, which is 2 plus the remainder divided by the divisor, which is negative 2 over x squared plus 1. So this expression becomes x ln of x squared plus 1 minus the integral of 2 minus 2 over x squared plus 1 dx. Notice how 2 is the quotient we got from the polynomial long division, and minus 2 over x squared plus 1 is the remainder, negative 2, divided by the bottom part of the rational function, which is x squared plus 1. In general, when we have a rational function and the degree of the numerator is not less than the degree of the denominator, we can do polynomial long division with the numerator as the dividend and the denominator as the divisor. Then we can rewrite the rational function as the sum of the quotient and the remainder divided by the divisor, which is always the denominator of the rational function. Alright, so since the integral involves a sum, we can split this into two separate integrals, and we write the integral as the integral of 2 dx plus the integral of negative 2 over x squared plus 1 dx. And notice how we're subtracting the entire integral, which is why we need the parentheses. Let's simplify the expression by distributing the negative sign and taking out a constant multiple. So this expression becomes x ln of x squared plus 1 minus the integral of 2dx plus 2 times the integral of 1 over x squared plus 1dx, since the negative in front of the parentheses and the negative in the second integral cancel out. So the last thing we need to do is to do both integrals separately. So the x ln of x squared plus 1 stays the same, and the integral of 2 is equal to 2x, so we need to write a minus 2x, and the integral of 1 over x squared plus 1 is arctan of x, which is a standard integral, and that's being multiplied by the constant of 2. So we need to add a plus 2 arctan of x, and we need to also add a constant c at the end. So the integral of ln of x squared plus 1 is x ln of x squared plus 1 
minus 2x plus 2 arctanovax plus some constant c.